A flea-borne disease is on the rise in Bear County, and your pets could be helping to spread it. Garrett Berger talked to a local veterinarian who had her own battle with marine typhus about what you could do to prevent and protect against this disease. Here's a flea right here. Dr. Olga Jaimez is back at work again at her veterinary clinic after weeks away while she suffered from urine typhus. I was in the hospital for six days and I thought I was going to die. Now she's sounding a warning about this disease, which is transmitted by infected fleas, though other animals can be involved in its spread too. This flea is biting the rat, then transmitting and jumping on the dog and cat that's carrying that same flea. And then the dog bringing it to the house and then the clients are getting bit. Jaimez believes she and one of her techs got the disease at work. At first, she had flu-like symptoms, but no flu. And within a few days, she was at the ER. And I had high fevers of 103. I had red spots all over my body. That's how I knew I had a zoonotic disease. She and her tech aren't alone. The number of cases has risen locally over the past few years, spiking last year with 101. And there have been 56 cases so far in 2019, with five months to go. Now, the best way to stay safe is to make sure your pets are flea-free. Unfortunately, this poor guy came in with them. Now, Dr. Jaime says that shampooing will get rid of fleas, but it won't provide any residual protection. So the best way is to use veterinary prescribed medications. Though non-pet owners aren't fully safe either. You know, but you certainly still could get typhus by just hiking, camping, if there's been any wildlife, like possums around. Jaime said it took a bit to convince her doctors to treat her for zoonotic disease, though a test later confirmed she had typhus. So beyond taking precautions, she wants people to keep it in mind as a possibility if they get sick. You know, whether it's really the flu, if you turn out negative, maybe consult and ask, you know, your doctor about, hey, test me for typhus. Garrett Berger, KSAT 12 News.